It's been said that you play baseball, play football, or play basketball. You don't play fighting. To put yourself on the line against an opponent trained to defeat you is not something for the weak-minded. Because while mastering all combat sports disciplines is necessary to compete, to succeed, a fighter must have the heart and determination to walk through fire in search of victory. Tonight, the journey begins. Far from the bright lights of Las Vegas or New York City, but as the saying goes, when the octagon door shuts, a fight's a fight. And all right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome here to Ash's first fight in the WFA. I'm sorry, the creation looks like shit. The, the UFC and the EA creations just do not look good at all. It looks nothing like the GTA character. But yeah, this story is Ash is becoming a professional boxer, and this is her journey. If you don't know, Ash, she is a character that I made in GTA, and I roleplay as her. Yep, let's get into this fight. Here we go. The breath rings about, and I can just touch glove here. Ash is in the red. This is her first prof er, yeah, professional fight here in the WFA. Will she find her way to the big leagues in the UFC and become women's champion? Who knows? Oh, but a big punch there by her opponent. Comes back with a left hook. Big jab there, though. And just trying to find her, her pace in this matchup. Ash Flood trying to just find her balance here. Obviously, newcomer. Oh, what a head kick! Obviously, newcomer with all this boxing. And she is used to living the high life in Los Angeles. Big head kick misses. Big block, though. And this is her first professional fight. Big head kick block, though. This is big block there, though. And could this be the end? Dig knockdown! Ash! Could we go for a takedown here? Here we go! Ash! Could we go for the finish here? Yes, and she does! She scores her first knockdown in the first round! And Ash is your winner here in the first round knockout. Big head kick causes the knockdown. And then her opponent was left stranded on the ground. And the punches came in bunches. And the eyes rolled back and the match was over before you even knew it. And here we go, the winner. Her first match. Ash Flood, winner by knockout. And this will go well for her resume. Alright, so now we're in the hub here. I'm only going to be showing maybe two rounds of training maybe if I do five weeks or however long the camp is of training two weeks of training so why, why, why can't I have that here that's pretty fun who shall we fight on the undercard four weeks yeah so if it's a four week camp I'll only show two weeks of the camp um who should we go for we go for a tougher opponent here I want to have an interesting game you know but I'm only going to show two weeks here so the opponent we're fighting has five wins and three losses so this should be handy, hopefully. Uh, yes, we are going to. Four weeks, we'll do only two in the video. But, uh, it's just the same thing over and over again, so I don't want to be repetitive, you know. But here we have the upcoming fight now. I'm going to promote. Gain followers. Popularity. We'll jump rope to get our stamina and health up a bit. Then shadow boxing to get our striking up. Protein shake to get her health up. Bicep curls. Jump up again. Yeah, I think I'm going to miss. Look, just straight up. Okay. Jump up again. And then we'll drink the protein shake. Then we'll do the protein shake to end the day. Alright, so that is one week of training done. And we'll go into the next set, we'll promote again. And we 
train, we'll go some for heavy train today, we'll go for neighborhood bike ride, get our stamina and health up, always important in boxing, do that again. We do have a minor injury though, which is not good, so we will have to train up and shape for this. And then we will buy some cut off to get our strength and with you. Alright, and now the rest will be cut out from the video, so I'll see you guys in the fight. Okay, we've got the crowd already. Ash is ready against her opponent here. Oh, no shine of respect, I clutched there. Good head kick there by Ash. The no shine of respect, that's gonna piss her off. You can see the, the anger in her eyes there when she didn't show the respect and not teeing off with some lefts and rights. Good catch blocks it there. Big block there by Ash. Oh, big shot to the body, I think Ash. May have counted that just a tiny bit. Big kick though. Shot to the body again. To Ash. Shot to the left leg. Big knee counter though. Oh, I think I think maybe Kosh got a bit of it. She didn't get all of it. Big shot to the right leg there. Hard kick dodged. Buddies ladies are just trying to find each other's comfort zone and try and attack on it. As you can see, Ash is very confident with the head kicks. She probably should be going for the finish here, but... So take a step back, another head kick. Stunning her opponent momentarily. And this could be it, but uh, Ash misses with too many punches. Shot to the left leg there. Oh, big shot to the stomach. Body kick dodged. Head shot. Oh, head kick, you could hear the impact of that one. Oh my god. Another shot. Counter. Oh my god, big punch. Ash looks on. Ash looks on here. Going to the ground. This is not Ash's strong shot, but she manages to get out of it. Going for the back mount now. She pops us up. This might be over. Oh, big punch there, but Ash is out of stamina here. And she looks tired. Yeah, Ash looks tired, she needs to have a breather here. And she just gets up on time. Big body shot, but countered again by Kutch. Big takedown again. Going to half guard now. Ash just about manages to get out of it. Ash looks to be in a bit of trouble here. Big counter there. Big combination. Misses with about two punches there. Still a very good combination. Going for the left and right hook. Another takedown here by Koch. Ash goes to the ground again. This time she's fast to get up. Oh, big shot. I do not think we're going to see another first round knockout by Ash here. Or maybe we might. No, I think it's just a bit too late here. And end the round one. I think Koch is going to be going into this round with the advantage. As she scored three takedowns against Ash. And Ash looks a bit damaged here. Oh my god, what a counter! Ash took a play out of Koch's book and went for a no respect and now just countering, teeing off with punches. Oh, but no, you can hear the snap. You can hear the snap in the right leg. And Ash looks hurt. Ash looks really hurt here. You could hear that snap echo throughout this arena. As a leg kick connected beautifully. And a big body kick. Oh, a spear! A big spear takedown. And Ash again looks to be in trouble. Trying her best to break out of it, and she does. Oh, she has no stamina. She's tired. She looks fatigued here. Body kick. Head kick connects. But there's not enough power in those punches that she's fatigued. Oh, and a beautiful body shot. A beautiful body shot. And Ash looks hurt. Ash looks really hurt here. I think she should take a breather here. 
She looks insanely hurt here. Another beautiful body shot. Head kick connects again. Going for an upper connection there, but couldn't connect fully. Big head kick. Just trying to find the connection, but she can't quite break through the great defense of Koch here. Beautiful connection there, takes her by surprise. Again, wasting too much stamina, she needs to slow down with her punches. Big body kick. And now she's going for the finish. It looks like Ash might be out. Ash is out, no! She survived. She survived just a little bit longer. I do not know how the hell she did that. But she fights on just a little bit longer in this matchup. And side control here. Ash takes the momentum. Oh, she's too tired to even go for anything big there. I think Ash might be out here. I think the ref should call for this and Ash looks too hurt to continue. Two big significant punches in this round alone. Oh, and she's faint kick there. I think Koch might have this matchup in the bag. And yes, another body kick knocked her down. And Ash is hurt. Ash is hurt really bad here. I'd be extremely surprised if Ash, managed, Ash manages to find a way to recover. And again, the body kick was about to connect there. That might have been the end of the game. That might have been the end of the round. Ash is too hurt. Look at her. Ash can barely continue. Another brutal body shot and the round's over. Ash manages to survive, to survive and look at her. She is battered and bruised and she can barely even walk. It definitely looks like Koch is going to take this round if this goes to a judge's decision. And only her second match up here. She caught her! She caught her! She caught her! She caught her! She saw the leg kick coming! She saw the leg kick coming and she countered it! Big punch there, but again, Ash just can't connect. Oh, and a brutal head kick! You could hear that. Oh! But head kick of her own! A head kick of her own! No, but she's too tired to fight. Oh, head kick! What the hell? Ash! No, she's too tired to finish it off here. Oh, she has no stamina to finish it off, but that was a great knockdown there. And just getting back to her feet here. Ash is so tired right now, and she cannot do anything. This goes to ground again. This might be over. And yeah, I think she call. I think she sees it as well. It's going for a brutal ground and pound here. Half guard now. I think Ash's goal right now is just to survive. Oh, Ash is out. Ash is out. The brutality of Koch was too much for Ash. But she put up a hell of a fight. And the experience just took over. That head kick, if she had a bit more fight in her, if she had a bit more stamina, that might have been over. But those brutal, two brutal body shots in the second round really paid the advantage then. The winner by knockout is Julia Koch. And in her second match, she finds a victory or a loss. She has been defeated in her second matchup. This cannot be good. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen, for her Ash's third fight in the WFA. She's going against Leah Gardner. And the tail of the tape here. A big advantage, except for reach for Leah Gardner. Ash wasn't successful in her last fight, losing by a TKO or knockout oh, sorry not TKO big spinning fist there by Gardner 
And I think Ash learned from her last fight to save some, save some breathing room. And not go all out in the first opening round. And again, she's just trying to find her, her space here. And look at that, see, beautiful connection. Big body shot connecting. Again, Ash needs to... Oh, big headshot. Ash realistically needs to be connecting with those shots. Or oh, she's just going to waste out of stamina. Really quickly. But I could be sneaking out of my ass right now. Because it could be over in a matter of seconds. No, she gets up in the nick of time. Oh, big counter. Big head kick! Knocked down! And this might be it. The big head kick. Ground and pound. No, but Gardner just manages to get up in time. But it might have been enough. It might have been enough. No, it is. Oh, big leg kick. That's shot teeing off with a beautiful combination. Going all around the body to the head, to the body, to the legs. But I think the left leg, you can hear the snap again. No, she's losing too much stamina again. She needs to be careful. Oh, Gardner missed. Gardner missed with that punch. I know Ash is going on the advantage here. But again, wasting too much time. But look at that. It could be over. Yes, it is. And Ash wins by knockout. She is two for one right now. And what a performance again in the first round knockout. With a beautiful head kick. And then the pounding in the corner just... Oh, you can see it a moment. There it is. And a winner by knockout is Ash Flood. Really performance here. And I'm sure this will do great for her career. But alright guys, I am gonna leave that video here. Hopefully you enjoyed it. If you did leave a like, comment, share, subscribe and all that good stuff. But yeah, if you're enjoying my videos please leave a like, comment, share and all this uh, comment share and all that good stuff. Bring it back the old intro or outro bitches. I miss doing this. I haven't really done any videos by myself for a while. I haven't done videos with my cousin, as you saw. Doing GTA with him, doing Miss Baker missions. Dicking around with him. And online. Doing some real company with him. He's the highlight of my channel right here. He brings a fucking comedy. He is over here, there, Sky. And I want you to go subscribe to his channel, even though he's not here right now. Subscribe to both of his channels. I'll leave them in the description. Clan Vegito Gaming. And I can't remember what his, his main channel is called. But I'll leave a link to both of their channels. He is a sick guy. He is brilliant. And he really... Yeah, he's just amazing. So yeah, go subscribe to him. Uh, I'm sure we'll do more videos next week with him. Uh, if you enjoyed this video, please leave a like, comment, share, and all the good stuff. And I'll see you guys in the next video.